Our livers have important roles in our bodies as filters of our blood, but for those with liver disease, the organ doesn't function how it should and can cause further harm if we're not mindful of the symptoms. But the question is, what are the signs that our bodies are struggling? Ferd Lyle joins us with more. In patients with cirrhosis of the liver, the toxins from the gut can enter the bloodstream and reach the brain, where it may impact brain function. This can ultimately cause overt hepatic encephalopathy, or OHE. The warning signs can be hard to spot, as patient Mark Bollinger explains. I was originally diagnosed with cirrhosis due to NASH, and then that led to my hepatic encephalopathy and overt AG diagnosis. Um, some of my early symptoms were like confusion, disorientation, and like long sleeping periods and episodes. Um, that led to some more severe behavioral changes um, where I was like extremely disrespectful and rude to my mom, who was my caregiver, um, which was totally out of character for me. Um, she took me to the ER, it scared her so bad, um, which led to several more hospitalizations. Um, I actually wasn't diagnosed with overt HE until probably over a year from my beginning symptoms. Mark's journey is not uncommon, says clinical hepatologist, Dr. Nancy Rowe. Like Mark said, the symptoms of this are pretty subtle sometimes. So, um, you know, we might miss early clues if we're not really looking carefully for them. And they're not going to be the same from person to person and even in that same person. And they're episodic because the amount of toxins isn't exactly the same at every moment. So these waxing and waning symptoms are often things that people are embarrassed about. Maybe they don't want to talk to their family. They're scared that they might be labeled as, as crazy or demented. And it leads to a big delay in identification and, and treatment. To learn more about HE, its symptoms and treatment options, go to understandinghe.com.